Hello, everyone. Today, the presentation of my talk is how can we utilize Wikidata to protect Puma, an endangered language. Languages in Taiwan have recorded the Puyuma language. However, there are a lot of differences across the Puyuma dialects. In order to improve upon the current Puyuma dictionaries and current textbooks, I'm working on a strategy that includes first, a lexicographical based grocery database, second, mapping, and third, potentially linguistic analysis based on the use of the of the tools from Wikidata and Wikipedia. However, due to the limitation of this talk, I will, I will be only speaking on the existing non-link open data set and the search result on the Wikidata tool. Yes, in these talks, I will be covering the overall situations of the Puyuma language, the urgency to save the Puyuma language, the scarcity of the language, and how can you help reverse the situations by using Wikimedia? And here's is a list of the tribes in Taiwan. They are Ataya, Paiwan, Armenians, Lukai, Zhou, Bunan, Huyuma, Sakisiat, <laughs> Yamin, Tao, Teruko, Kavalan, Sakizaya, and Sedik. Yes, and this is the existing data about Puyuma. They are mostly based on the records from our government, institutionals, and educational partners and who have com computed the data. First, this is uh, from the website from the uh, Zheng uh, University and they have a they have have they have a, a anthropological departments and for them they have computed a uh, ethnographical data that which um includes uh, Puyuma. Yes, and this is a list of uh data they have captured and also recorded under ethnographicals. And this is actually you can see that this is under our Council of Indigenous um, Peoples. And third. On the Libraries of Congress, you can see that, as I mentioned earlier, there are a few um, Bainan dialects has been recorded. This is a lexicographical base. So you have seen uh, Bainan, Panapayan, uh, Penan, and Pinlang, and Pinot, Pinot, Pinamar, Pigment, and Puma. And these are um, these can be referred to the same, but but due to the um, the polynomials are uh, properties of the data data structure so it can actually have um, multiple um, terminologies that appears in being recorded on the libraries of congress data and therefore we can also see that there are also Puyuma people and the and the Puyuma languages and they are based on several scholastic sources. And lastly um, you have also seen that uh, there are records from the National Libraries of Israel and as usual, um, these topical terms they are actually have different uh, variation derivative and and here this is a search result on the Wikidata tool. Firstly, Puyuma's LD, LD link open data on Glen, and there are twenty eight files in the category trees. Eight files were views, twenty two pages on Wiki's entries, and total. 10,440 false views that data of one page could not be loaded to from the WNF page view application error. Um, this is sometimes due to the abstractions of data. And here, let's say if you access first to background tool and go to one of the entry, we can find that this is the Puyuma people in a formal clothing. And it links to the relevant uh, wiki, wiki entries, and for example, Puyuma tribes or the or the Nanwang tribes, and all these are the several tribes that have have um, the link open data that under this property, Puyuma peoples in formal clothing. And as we use the locator tools, we can see that there are several files and multimedia sources that have been attributed to this and. 
Also, and don't forget that every our date photo has a GPS property. And therefore, once you extract this property, and you can use our OpenStreetMap to show the exact location. But in this case, um, due to the table privacy issues, I did not show the exact location of where is this picture being taken on this relevant map. And next, as I said earlier, and um, you can actually extract the GPS location. But in this case, this is the pictures of a historical painting. And this case that it was not show the actual location of the of this of this picture, but rather the location of this picture. For example, it could be kept in a uh, museums in Taiwan, and that will shows the location of the institutions. And don't forget that we have a sister project which is uh, goes well with uh, OpenStreetMap. OpenStreetMap, um, as I said earlier, it reviews and also collab uh, complements um, the GPS data of, of the Wikidata. And therefore, usually, Wikidata is the object located. Um, and for us, um, GPS itself is an attribute of the photos. The reason why we're showing P625 is P625 is a property to locate the Puyuma. Yes, and also under Q, under the Q property, this which also another important terminology for the Wikidata, Puyuma has a Q property of Q seven zero six five zero zero, and for the, for that you can actually review um this link to the Library of Congress and National Library of Israel's ID and how it appears on the creative um on the Commons categories. And here these are the these are the relevant Q items on Puyumas, and this is all these that can all link to the Puyuma. As I said, there are some discrepancy and. There are some discrepancy and where people are key in the data and Puyuma can refer to the Puyuma as a general term, generic term, the the people, and how is there are some sub uh, categories and for example phonologies and grammars and they are not under the same terms when people create a data entry. And for example, under the Puyuma people and you have um an option actually to introduce um your contribution to the Puyuma, for example, here. This is a place for you to contribute to your parts. Here, these are the list of uh, photos that have been uploaded by many people. They uploaded their images, for example. Um, this is a take, this image photo have been taken when people visit the Puyuma tribes, or there are also some. Uh, photo you can see that obviously historical and there could be uploaded by people who have um, access to literature of materials and they pro they fit, they also they upload their historical photo they relating to Puyumas and onto this um, Puyumas category and how you can actually contribute uh, about Puyuma yes you can do your part by upload um, the photos, upload the photos we here, and these are the steps. For example, but however, under conditions that you must first register as a wiki, Wikipedia or under Wikimedia. The Wikimedia is a huge ecosystem. First, let's define how Wikidata fit into this Wikimedia ecosystem. Wikidata is the link open data project for the Wikimedia projects. The Wikimedia Foundation is an organization that runs a Wikimedia project. The Wikimedia Foundation has a chapters all over the world, including Germany. Wikimedia Deutschland is a non-profit organization that builds and maintains Wikidata. There are other Wikimedia projects, sister projects that you may come across as you edit, such as Wikipedia's, Wikidictionaries, and Wikibooks, among the others. 
since Wikidata items can use media, I can also hear about Wikimedia's comments, which is the media repository that all Wikimedia projects use. It's similar to Wikidata in that other Wikimedia project, which pulls the images and other medias from the central repository. It is a difference from Wikidata in the comments and it is exclusively for media. Like what I mentioned earlier, it's for you to store uh, the photos. And when you actually encounter some uh, historical art photos of Abu Yuma, you can actually also upload. And Wiki Education is a non profit organization that's separate from Wikimedia. It teaches individuals how to use and contribute to Wikimedia objects. We envision a broader and more diversified Wikimedia ecosystem and welcomes public and academic contribution in which the students, the scholars, and institutions of higher learning are actively engaged in investigating and representing the language. As you can see, that um, we can say Wikidata is almost functioned like a back end, and it, it, it's an SQL language that which it organizes and arranges um, the items and arrays of items that appears in the Wikimedia projects. And here is the list of biographies that that's relevant for my talks. And the first four are the link open data that have already been categorized and to compute on the relevant data for the um, Puyuba language. And you also have some tools that which developed by my other colleagues that are working on to improve on um, glance, locators, and squeeze and scholar, which these tools they help to facilitate people to extract data from the using Wikidata to extract data from the Wikimedia Commons. And let's say if you are interested to know about how to operate uh, this Wikidata, then you can go to this outreach dashboard and to read about the training materials. And lastly, and there's another project which a scholastic contribution to the, to the Puyma language that can be found in these academic institutions. Okay, um, this is the end of my talk, and I wish that um, maybe you can post about five minutes here, and we can discuss, and and I will be online at this time, and we can actually share and and tell me what you think about this talk, and how can I improve on this, and if you have any questions, you can also send to my email address here.